Hello everyone and thanks for stopping by to Scrap and Craft with Terry. Today we're going to start a new weekly challenge and it's put out by Suzanne at Nonstop Paper Crafts. This is a challenge she's going to do every Tuesday and let me see this is the first challenge in the series. Each Tuesday she'll give us a um, three prompts that we will use to alter our index cards with and so the challenge is um, called altered index 2024 so pop over by her channel and check it out seems like it's going to be a really really fun um, challenge to do every week so if you like my video today, I just ask that you check out my other videos and like and subscribe and hit the bell and YouTube will notify you when I upload new videos. So, after all of that stuff, let's get started. Now, the prompts for today are dark blue, sweet, and scraps. Now sweet can be anything like um, sweets that you eat or um, a thought you had, oh that's sweet, or a picture, an event, anything like that. So I had to rack my brain a little bit on this and in, in her first video she did one with a stack of pancakes and I thought about doing something with um, a cake or pie, something like that in it. And then I thought, well, I really didn't know if that's what I wanted to do. And just kept thinking and thinking. And the other night I was listening to music on YouTube and popped into my head music. I think music is sweet. So that's what I'm going to do for uh, my challenge. Now she uses um, index cards that are four by six and this is a homemade index card because I, I don't have any of the big ones until I get to the store to buy one. This works just fine. This is just notebook paper on the back. And this is just a little bit heavier of a, a printer paper. So I just outlined it or um, inked it the outside in blue and just kind of um, just, you know, um, I know what I'm trying to say. Just went over it with my blue ink just to highlight it a little bit. So for my dark blue, it's going to be this piece of paper at the top. And I really had to look hard to find these prompts. And I finally found them on Pinterest. So I thought that was great. So... These are records for anybody that doesn't know what a record is. And I just cut out some, some uh, music notes. Let me see. I think that one goes on the back. And my title is going to say and include the word sweet. Um, the let me see the sweet sound of music and if you've watched my videos before you know that I try to have everything cut out everything inked and everything ready to go and then I like 
60s oldies music. So, I thought that just looked pretty cute. So, I'm going to glue on this top header thing. So each week we'll do something new and that'll be that'll keep it interesting. That'll be a lot of fun. It's a little bit different than doing something, you know. Some of these challenges are every day, which is fine. But sometimes, you know, can't keep up with every day. They're all a little different and they're all fun. So now I think I'll glue on my records first. I really had to hunt and hunt and hunt to find these records. And with the records on here and the top of this, if you grew up back then it would almost look like a boom box because these records look like the speakers yeah get that one too low try to keep them about even maybe move this one down a little bit I might have got one cut just a little bit smaller than the other one. So, this is not going to be a long video. I just lay them there and then I have a half idea of where each one goes. Instead of laying them straight across, I thought it looked kind of cute arched. And these words came out of a kid's um, dictionary that I got at a... I don't know if it was a library book sale or if I got it at a yard sale. So, the blue paper on top can be considered scraps. Um, These words actually can be also, but now these here, 60s and oldies, I stamped on just scrap pieces of paper. So then were also my scraps. I stamped them and then my ink wasn't dark as light I wanted it so I just went over it with a sharpie okay so it stuck to the paper Is here but I thought it was really cute that I found a word that actually said music with like a music motif with it so I thought that was pretty cool
I like music. When I'm bored, I can sit down, put my music on, and just get lost in it. I like all kinds of music, but like 60s and early 70s, yeah, them are my favorites. Now on the back, I'm just going to put this little music note, and it has speakers in it. So it's like it's playing the music to you. Just going to put that down on the bottom. And on the back, this would make a um, cute journal card. We're supposed to do this every week for a whole year, every Tuesday. So I can't wait to see the variety of stuff when we're all done with it. And that would make like its own little, um, its own little um, book, booklet, journal, whatever you might want to call it. I just have to trim this off a little tiny bit. Must have got it on there cockeyed. So there you go. There's my first video to to the um well let me see again my first video to the altered index 2024 challenge so let me know what you think questions comments any ideas leave them below in the in the comments I answer all my comments let me know if you like it so until we um, do our next video I hope everyone has a good day and happy crafting bye for now